champion. We are here today. You know, usually I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, and I'm minding my own business. Mm. Doing whatever I feel like, you know, checking out the latest IG models. Shout out to Bundles of Britney. Oh, I love her. Um, I'm on Twitter, looking at, you know, a few people, a few things, uh, movie references, and then I, I just scroll across a tweet from DNA, a.k.a. The Champ, yeah, yeah. and he's uh, talking to Lloyd yeah, Banks. Yeah. You know, talking to Lloyd Banks, like, uh, Lloyd, The Champ thinks Lloyd Banks should jump in the ring or something to that matter. I don't have the exact... I have the particular... Oh, okay, okay, you can, you can take it from here then. Uh, DNA... <clears throat> DNA says the champ heard because DNA's been oh. he's a self-proclaimed champ yeah, he's been calling champ. himself the champ so DNA exactly says like champ. he's talking <laughs> referring to himself in third person he said the champ heard Lloyd at Lloyd Banks is willing to kill a ninja on URL but it gotta be an industry rapper is this true Lloyd Banks retweets quote that's a fact so Lloyd Banks um it's it's, it's it's ready. You, you know he's active. He tweeted, yeah. "Oh, Red's going for champion again." Yeah, Salute he, the Lloyd Banks. He watches champion. Appreciate he, that. Uh, he, he tweeted on April fourth, "Oh, Red is going for champion again." He knows yeah. what that means. He also tweeted April sixth, "Aver vs. New Jersey Twerk was fire." So he's well into the sport of battle rap, and now he said, "Look, let's get it in. Let's go." Yeah, I mean, you have a guy like Lloyd Banks follows the culture closely. To see even following, you know, champion people to to, to battle rappers mm -hmm. tweeting out what he said, so he's in tuned. Uh, how do you feel about him saying it has to be an industry rapper? It can't uh, be a battle rapper because you know me personally, I kind of don't want to see a battle rapper. You know I do I mean? too. I want I want to see you against you know one of our own. I want to see him against a battle rapper. Um, Cats, look to Cats, angry fans. He had a whole fan. he had a hold up graph. You with that battling Lloyd Banks on URL and graph graph uh, repeated. Yeah, I'm with it. So graph wants a piece of Lloyd Banks. He wants to get in on the action. But uh, back to your question, I want to see him go against a battle rapper. I don't want to see him go go in because because you know, Lloyd Banks to me, I think Lloyd Banks is a problem. And I think yeah. the new day and age fans they love to hear punchline. And I think Lloyd Banks is a heavy puncher. Lloyd Banks has been punching his entire career. Like, do y'all listen to the music? That's all he does. So I think he, I think he would fit very well. I think um, the movement, I think the only thing he has to worry about is his movement, delivery, composure. Because everybody has a plan until they face their opponent and their opponent start getting some haymakers yeah. off on them. And then they're not as confident as they was when as they was before. So I don't know how he would look on stage with a battle rapper with angles. They might have some G-unit angles. They might, you know, and I don't know if that would shake him up. And he would, you know, when it's time for him to rap, he might not deliver yeah. like he normally would on, yeah. on a track. But I, I think he really can do well. And I, I want to see Lloyd Banks versus Cassidy. Cass, I mean, you, you call you, you, you can, but you, you know, I, I disagree. Let's Cassidy get Cassidy is fire. Oh my goodness. Cassidy is, ha is a heavy puncher as well. Two heavy punchers. Two heavy punchers. Lloyd Banks is a heavy puncher. Cassidy is a heavy puncher. I want to see them battle. That's who I want to see battle. I want to see Floyd Mayweather and Mike Tyson battle. Guess what? It won't happen. Okay. It won't happen. Cassidy and Lloyd Banks won't happen. Why? Not because of the asking price. You know what I'm saying? We, we know for a fact Cassidy says, hey, if you get Cassidy for 100K, that's considered a discount. That is a discount. He wants 200 or more. He deserves 100K at least. But 200 is pretty steep. Yeah. You know Unless what I mean? they plan on taking it to uh, HBO or something like that. And then you got to, can, can he sell that amount, amount of tickets? Can, like, will it happen like that? Uh, you got to think, when battle rappers return, the mystique is gone. Oh, we've seen what you can do. Cass did not too long ago battle disaster. He did. So that return factor, oh my God, Cass, he's finally back. It's in gone. a sense, is gone. It's gone. So does he not factor the price into that? Saying, ah, man, okay. The big draw, me packing a building. See what I can, we we kind of seen what he can do. We kind of seen what he would do. So the price should be more so inclined for Lloyd Banks. We don't know what Lloyd Banks will look like on that stage. But Cassie, uh, to me, I would rather grab because of that. I don't want to wait. I don't want oh, Lloyd Banks versus Cassidy in discussions, and we wait two more years. Mm. No. I, yeah. Oh, I, oh my goodness. I'd rather it be a graph. Mm. Uh, 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 um, who else? A King Los. 
Yeah. Uh, somebody that we know it can get happen within a year. I, talk, I spoke to Lloyd Banks. He's ready. I spoke to this battle, uh, a battle rapper or industry artist, and he's ready. Going down, Gnome 9. Going down, Sir Madness 8 or 7 or whatever they're going down. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Or Smack Volume 5. Lloyd Banks versus such and such. I'd rather that. Other than that, I hate the long negotiation process. I mean, I, Graf, Graf, uh, I think Graf would be dope. I mean, yeah. Graf, uh, he had a disc record back in 2013 where he uh, came at Kendrick Lamar. This was when Kendrick had that fire track yeah, yeah. where he came at everybody in the industry. Um, responding, to, uh, 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 he said, uh, I'd rather battle, I'd rather battle rap than have a friendship while these rappers French kiss. So he, he said back in 2013, he'd rather battle rap. So he's well in tune with battle rap. He has that in his blood. Yeah. He said, I'd rather battle rap back then. So, I mean, I don't know, man. Like, I like the matchup, but Cassidy, man, is just... Ca Cassidy is the reason why I started battle rapping. Oh. Like, we can go back. First of all, he's a Philly native. Oh, yeah. And, and, so and, and, Cassidy for that? And, and everybody remembers when Cassidy and Freeway. Put on a beat. Put on a beat. Put a beat on. Come on. This is back when VHS was popping. The, uh, uh, a battle came I was on video and I remember watching a, a, a video in my living room and I'm the youngest brother out of all my brothers and they would pick on me and you know I try to get their attention they say get out of here we watched that battle on VHS in my living room and I seen how in all my brothers were they was in awe of watching Cassidy spit them uh, uh, smoking like pipers teeth and they was I was like yo how, I know how to get their attention now I'm gonna be a battle rapper and here you go. Now it is here. It is me. Ten, fifteen years later, I'm here. Yeah. But he is the reason why I started watching battle rap. Cassidy is well known in my city for destroying people. He calls himself Mr. Five Thousand, Mr. Five Thousand and One. No, yeah. <laughs> no one has beat Cassidy in a battle. I would love to see Cassidy versus Lloyd Banks. I know Grab. To me, I think Lloyd Banks would get over on Grab. To me personally, I think Lloyd Banks. You don't think Lloyd Banks would get off on Cassidy? No, no. It's one to watch. I disagree. It's one to watch. And I, I think disagree. Cassidy won that battle. It's one to watch. I disagree. It's one to watch because Lloyd Cassidy knows how to battle. Lloyd Banks knows how to. He, I'm pretty sure he can punch. battle and he can punch. But Cassidy got he got it all figured out. It would be a dope he did, he did battle. Be disaster. It would be a dope battle. But Cassidy has more battle experience than Lloyd Banks. Does. That's that's a fact. That's a, I, I'll give you the experience factor, but I feel like you know the punches. And, and, you know, Lloyd Banks' believability fact, it's a lot that he can say, a lot he'll come across with. So, I, I mean, hopefully the match gets booked. I hope so. Hopefully somebody would, you know, affirm. I feel like, I'm going to say this for every league. Every league that's out there, when y'all negotiate, I got to do a better job of, like, breaking down the analytics to the people. Like, yo, this is what the, the projection is. This is what the rumor out is. This is what you may bring in. Can you counteract that? It's more so, yo. I need 200000 No, I can't get that to you. Come on. No, I, I need somebody to really like break it, a structured breakdown of how much I can give you and why. Because mm -hmm. there's no reason why a battle rap, I mean, or, or cash to say 200 that's it. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to negotiate with, uh, you know, like I said before, go to Walmart and say the, the milk is this much. Nah, this milk doesn't look that good. I, I, I want to pay a dollar for this. No, it, we, we have, you know, numbers showing why this, the milk costs as much mm -hmm. and that's it. Same thing Mayweather can ask for a hundred million a fight because, because projection, like you said, yeah, he, he has knows, a management team. He knows he can bring that revenue in. The pay per view numbers are through the roof. Mm -hmm. He's one of the best, biggest pay per view draws in sports history. Yeah, and he can go out and make hundred, two hundred, three hundred yeah. million for one fight because he's proven time and time after time that I'm a big draw. Yeah. People are not only going to buy the tickets to get in the venue, that's going to sell out within minutes. Not only that, but the pay-per-view numbers are going to be yeah. good. And everyone profits. That's why they want Floyd to fight so much. So when Floyd says 100, 100 million, they're like, okay, yeah, that's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get 10 million on the back end for myself mm -hmm. after I pay you. I'm going to get 110 million and thanks for the 10 million as opposed to these guys. We don't know that. A lot of times it's a loss because Cassidy battled on ether. That whole situation is done. Yeah. Like, like it, there is no more ether. There is no more. No, that that situation is completely done. Yeah. And if I was Alki Alki David, mm. he's a millionaire, a billionaire. Mm. If he doesn't want to reinvest into that situation, why should the rest of the battle world do? Mm. Like, so it's like, come on, come on, Cassidy. If you want to jump back in the ring, or like, all right, it could be this way. You know, I spoke to a lot of battle rappers. Maybe you can. Maybe you can get two hundred thousand. But don't get $200 from the leagues. 
get promotions on your side. Like charge smack or um, 50 to 100K and then get advertising money from somewhere else. Right. You know what I mean? Because uh, they posted this on Instagram. And then French Montana actually suggested. Oh, yeah, that's right. French Montana French suggested Montana. Cassidy. So you got eyes like French Montana on you. I'm pretty sure you can find out different ways to make money off situation, and not charge the league. Nice. So, I'm, that's all I'm saying. But I would love to see. It. I would prefer Cassidy, but the reality is it may not happen like that. That's true. And I, you know, I hate when reality comes in. But I want to see them against bad rappers. Though I, I love Lloyd Lloyd Banks versus who? Who do you think? Um, you, you like Red, Lloyd, you like Red, Lloyd versus Red, why not? That would be dope. Lloyd versus Twerk, you know? Lo uh, Lloyd Banks versus Av. Lloyd Banks versus Av. One of the cleanest punchers in the game. Yeah. Versus a, uh, somebody who's been the cleanest puncher in the industry. Yeah. And Graf, by the way, uh, not Graf, um, King Los yeah. puts out a tweet. He says, I'm, I'm not an industry rapper. I'm not even a rapper. The man is on Mars. Yeah. Somebody's going to die. He feels the way. He's, somebody's going to die. Whoever he's battling is going to die. I'm going to say this real fast. A disclaimer. You know what I'm saying? Um, we didn't know what Math was going to say. This show was very unscripted. Uh, so Math had a plan and it, seemed, it worked. He used the right platform. Mm -hmm. So I'm I'm a, I'm a thousand percent sure King Lowe's saw that entire video. He did. On how you know he feels about industry coming in. Because he tweeted out. I'm not an industry yeah. rapper, and I yeah. know where that came from. Oh, yeah. You saw Champion. You seen how disrespectful Math was speaking. <laughs> Math was talk. Some of it was truth. Like yeah, he yeah, said, yeah, yeah. I mean, he did name a few, and I talked to Math off camera. He said, salute the Method Man. Method Man is one of the industry yeah, people yeah. that gives back to battle rap. He did a song with him for free. did a song with Cortez. Red Method, Man. Red Man. Method Lux, too. Right. Method Man hosts the show. Drop the mic. Uh, one of those. Oh, what, what, what show is it? Drop, drop the mic. Like a whole bunch of battle rappers on the back end. The behind the scenes. Behind it. Right. Coaching. Right, right. Before, we, right we know. Before. Salute the <laughs> Rome. Coaching. From Philly. I see Awkward. You. Awkward. Shilla right. Jones is on the air. So salute to them, um, but he did talk about a lot of industry people not, you know, not giving back to the, the giving back to the, the the sport. Excuse me, I said support and sport, giving back to the sport. You know, industry dudes, yo, y'all got the money, you know what I mean? Help out, you know, bring the, this is the purest form of hip hop. Bring us up, shoot, they could even put together something where as though. Uh, the industry dudes pick one of their pick their favorite battle rappers, and they and it's like a like a tournament. This coach has this guy. Uh, this guy fight. gets that guy. That guy has that guy. You can create create a whole show around it. You know what I mean? And and, and that could be that could build the hype up for battle rap. So I would love to see something like that. Industry guys, math made a great point. Support battle rap, mm -hmm. and um, but I think King Los is dope, and I think whoever he battles is gonna die. Back to what I was saying. Who do you think whoever King Lowe's battles is? And I know who he's battling. That person's going to die. You out your mind. He's going to die. I, mm, he's going to die hard with Make that the announcement so we can debate this, so we can drop that debate, man. All right, we'll see. We'll he's, see. He's going to die. We'll see. But like, like you said, though, as far as industry guys or, or high-level rappers, you know, they probably hate the industry word now, you know. I'm not in the industry. I'm not in the industry. Yeah, yeah. But you know what industry means. You're like a popular mainstream mm -hmm. rapper. Pop much. star, commercial. Yeah. Uh, you get twenty millions of video. You on Ocho Cinco stuff like that with mm -hmm. French Montana. You're a mainstream, you know, high level rapper. So that's I don't. And it's no disrespect to when we say industry, but um, these guys should pick teams. They do it for like the celebrity uh, games, the celebrity games. Uh, what do you call it? For? It's obviously the celebrity games. So why not Snoop Dogg? What's up? Mm -hmm. You tried it. You tried something like that before. Why not? So, so let's make those big things happen like that. That'd be so fun. That'd be crazy. Smack, you know, talk to these guys. I'm pretty sure you can get 50 Cent involved. Mm. Come on, man. That'd be crazy. And have the uh, uh, the uh, mainstream artists up there jousting and boasting yeah. and arguing with each other and just gloating about yeah. how good, you know, their artists did over this. You know, it'd be crazy, you know? Like they do on The Voice where yeah. those people pick their teams. Same type of scenario. You pick your battle rapper. This is who you want. You you know, you got your whole team lined up. This person has their team lined up. Everybody go at it, and then there's one winner at the end. Boom. Give the guy that wins 100 grand. Million. How about that? How about a million? Yeah. You create a whole show, a whole show around it. Yeah. I would love to see that, and and and, and I want to be a part of the writing. You know, <laughs> I may get in it, but I'll I'll write 
you know, the story, the narrative for the story. Yeah. I'm a good writer. I can write how to how to facilitate that. I'll get my brother, my co-star here. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll doctor it up. We'll call the show play by play. Yeah. You know, we'll be the people that uh, commentate on the show. Come on, let's do it. All the big guys out there with the money, make it happen. Yeah. Dope show. I want to say this. Let me just start naming. I know we're trying to video right here, but I'm fabulous. Hmm. You feel about Lloyd Banks versus Fabulous or Fabulous Battling? That would be crazy. We did see Fabulous Battling on Wild and Out. Yeah. You know, he kind of went at Hitman, these guys. He did, you know, he's punching pretty good and freestyling pretty good. So I want to see Fabulous in the ring as well. Fab ain't no joke. You know, maybe Fab. Fabulous versus Conceited. That'd be dope. Fat, the names even go together. Conceited, fabulous. fabulous. <laughs> on, I see what you're doing here. Yeah, you know, I come on, you're man. Doing. You're welcome. I see Make it happen, man. Yeah. yeah. Like, come on, you, you, you high level rappers, stop being scared. Shout out to Joe Budden, because Joe Budden, whether you feel like it or not, he, 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 he jumped in. Yeah, he does. You know, what I mean, full force, main event, and everything, and, and rapped. Whether he had the mic in his hand the whole time, you know, and actually dropping the mic at the end, in which he made the show drop the mic by him dropping the mic. <clears throat> but he jumped in. So guys, jump in. And and, and Joe Button is really active yeah. online. Yeah. He doesn't see a battle rap tweeting going, oh, I'm ignore it. He responds. Yeah. Man, what you talking about? He's going back and forth with April. Yeah. What, what's what's up though? Yeah. What, what, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you know what I mean, I'll leave it that. Champion. Champion. I was the one to hate. Nobody gave a damn. Told me to my face. I ain't in their plans now. I'm getting funnel cake. They wanna shake my hands, 